Oh, well, good, wonderful, beautiful morning, audience. These girls are in for a surprise. One, it's 82 degrees outside. See how long it takes Shelby to figure out that Jamie started to set up the pool. Oh, this ear stop. What is it, Shelby? What is it? What is it? What is it? This is like, it's my hose. It's over here though. It's already in the pool. I'm telling you, the hose is in the pool already. We're filling it super, super slow so that, um, <laughs> so that the water can warm up a little bit while it's going in there. Yes, your pool, yay! It's supposed to be 100 degrees this weekend, so we figure we better fill it up. What do you think? So I was like, I gotta check out all the things. I gotta make sure all the fun stuff's happening. Yeah? Looks like we're filling the pool. Miss Oakley's being the smart dog in the situation. She's like, I am gonna stay inside and nap in the air conditioning where it's cold. Good plan. That's where I wanna be too. <laughs> So it is actually supposed to be ridiculously hot up here the next couple of days. So it's time to fill the pool for the dogs. And hopefully it'll be nice for this weekend if Eric brings Lana over the dog. Maybe Lana can learn how to play in a bigger pool. We shall see. You figure out that the pool's got water in it? It's probably warm water. Oh, are you coming too? Memphis is like, I don't care. I'm getting in this pool. It's hot. Get in, Shelby. Get in! Memphis is like, I can't wait for my floaty. Yes, that's a hole. Get in, Shelby. Get in the pool. Get in the pool. What do you think? Are you going to show Lana how to use this pool this weekend if she comes over? What do you think, huh? Don't pop it. Shelby, get in. Shelby sees the hose. All right, I'll do it. <laughs> it's the only part you care about, huh? I think we did. I don't know if I hooked it up or not. Memphis is like, please don't get that on my face. <laughs> <laughs> you did that. I didn't move it. I didn't move it. You did that. <laughs> All right. It's in the water. He's going for it. He's going to grab it first. <laughs> Already getting too deep for you? <laughs> See, this is the perfect depth. She's good at the underwater thing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is no, this is we'll get both pools out so you can dig in one and swim in other. <laughs> See, we got it. She's like, this is mine. There she goes. <laughs> hey. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's still a little too much. All right. Kate, we have to leave it in there. The pool's never going to get filled. <laughs> oh, you know what else we need? We need Memphis's little, uh, the metal thing that she steps on. Oh, you girls. Memphis, you look all patriotic. You think everybody can guess what we're getting ready to do? I mean, it's pretty obvious. You only wear those collars during certain times, huh? We're making dog treats. We're gonna make some patriotic gummy stars. And uh, you guys will see these on the dogs channel. They're gonna go up on Monday, I don't know what day. No, I lied. They're gonna be have gone up on Friday the 29th, I think. So I don't know what day this is going up, but that's when they're going up. Shelby decided to get her head wet before we did this. So uh she's got a little bit of a wet head while we're getting ready to film this. 
What do you think, Miss Oakley? I hear you. Where'd you go? There she is. Look, you're patriotic too. Are you patriotic too? I know we're gonna do this in a hurry because we don't want to leave that air conditioner off for too long. It'll get hot in here real quick, won't it? So yeah, real quick it will. Okay, let's make some treats. So if you guys watch my main channel, youtube.com slash gone to the snow dogs, you've seen me make dog treats before. But one of the things I don't talk about much over there because I try to make like a good polished looking video is how frustrating it can sometimes be and how most of the time when you see me make a treat over there it's the first time I've ever made it so I don't even know if it's gonna work or not. I base it on things I've made in the past or the way things have worked in the past but it's a lot of guess and check and sometimes I literally have to start all over and I'm hoping I don't have to start all over today because this video is due up tomorrow and it's already Thursday and I got a late start so if I have to remake this video for tomorrow it is not gonna be fun but look Memphis is the only one in here still helping me. She's like, Mom, just finish making them already. Here is what I have. I have to put them in the fridge. This was my first time making like gelatin things with coconut milk. I really don't know if it's gonna work. There might have been, I might have, should have probably done half coconut milk, half water. So let's hope that these turn out. I may even have to leave them in overnight which would not be cool because it means if I do have to remake it, I have to remake it tomorrow at like five in the morning. So yeah, let's see how this turns out in a little bit here. Ooh, rough. My hiccups? No, it's rough. <gasps> Turn off my radio. Oh my gosh, copyrighted music. If we talk over it loud enough, yeah, it won't notice. So I was gonna say, I can barely hear it from here. So I think you're good. Uh, we're watering out at the farm again. It's probably dropped what? 15 degrees since the middle of the day yeah, today? It's probably 72 out. Alexa, oh wait. <laughs> oh, I still got the hiccups. <laughs> We're coming out to water before tomorrow. We have to do it really late in the evening and early early in the day because otherwise, I haven't been drinking guys. I don't know why I have the hiccups. <laughs> um, maybe you need to start. Maybe, maybe that'll fix it. Yeah. Cause uh, if we water when the sun's out, it'll burn everything. But it's looking good out here. We decided to come out for a ride. Like a it's looking pretty over there. I know it smells like cows. It smells. It smells like cows. Yep. That smells like money. <laughs> no, it smells like poop. <laughs> <laughs> uh, look at. We almost got the sunset. Oh, that's right. Almost. Stick around. I almost. Bet it'll come. I think so too. It'll be here. All right, we're heading home from the farm. Everything's watered. Jamie's eating bugs. Mosquitoes everywhere. Um, we just saw a deer over there, but he took off yeah, pretty quick. Home. Like, we're heading back home now. Oh my gosh, they actually worked. So they've been in the fridge for about four, maybe five hours now. It's already dark, so I'm gonna finish it up tomorrow. But they worked. I got one of the blue ones out. I'm gonna stick it back in there for now. Sweet! That's so cool. So the night takes an interesting turn. Look. We're at the hospital. I know it's not Jamie or I. It's actually my brother. A couple of vlogs ago, I took my brother to the hospital to have surgery on his chin uh, a couple weeks ago. And he called me tonight and there's like something sticking out of his chin and they think it might be a piece of surgical mesh and it's hurting him really bad. So he said he noticed it a couple days ago, but like today the pain level like skyrocketed throughout the day. So we decided to come to the hospital because he's it's kind of red and scary. Well, anyway, we thought we were just gonna come and they were gonna like tell us what it is and hopefully like either remove it or do something, but they just took him back for a CT scan. Javi's at home, it is 1.30 in the morning. It's going to be a long night. So yeah, he just went back for a CT scan to uh, see if there's like an infection bubble around it or something, I don't know. I'll ask him if he wants to say hi when he gets back, but uh, yeah. Tonight just got interesting. <laughs> Jamie brought me my laptop, so I was just getting on Twitter to check Twitter. And uh, yeah, we got a menagerie of things going on over here. We've actually already been here for about two hours, so hopefully it won't be too much longer after the CT scan's got done. But even at that, if they decide they're gonna have to remove it, we'll still be here for a while. Yeah, interesting stuff. His wife, Danielle, is at home with the baby. I'm like, do you want me to come here with him or do you want me to stay with the baby? It's probably better if you stay with the baby and I just come here. 
here. <laughs> so yeah, <sighs> what an interesting turn of events. Okay, so because I don't want to do this when I get home, I didn't film my brother while we were there. They did a CAT scan and they did blood work and they did all these weird things and then the doctor right at the very end goes, oh, I don't know what that is. It's a internal stitch. He had surgery not long ago, so he had internal stitches. We weren't sure if that's what it was or if it was mesh and it literally took the doctor five hours, six hours, to right at the end go, oh, I know what it is, it's an internal stitch. And why did you do a CAT scan and why did you do all this blood work and why did you do all these things? And then they went, we can't really help you here, you have to call a surgeon. <laughs> so we sat in the ER for six hours. <sighs> Thankfully though, they did give my brother something for the pain because he said it hurt quite a bit. Um, so now I guess he's just gonna have to call a surgeon. I'm on my way home, it is literally 5.06 a.m. I just stopped to film this because I didn't want to do it when I got in the house because I figured I would wake everybody up. So I'm gonna go ahead and tell you guys goodnight right now. If you're new to this channel and you like what you saw, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, like this video, and share it with your friends to help us grow the party. And as always, thanks so much for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Stay positive. Dream big. We will see you again soon. What a weird day. And I have a video I have to finish and a vlog I have to edit. And so I better go home and get some sleep because I have to be up in like uh, two and a half hours. Maybe we'll just make it three hours. We'll see. Anyway, good night, audience.